Okay, today we're going to be introducing the Ball Fireman Racer watches. I'm currently showing two different models of this watch. One's the black dial and one's the white dial. The model number for these watches is NM as in Nancy Mary 2088C-SJ. The white one would be dash WHBE at the end for white and blue. And the black dial version would end in dash BKWH for black white. They're both the same exact watches except for the dial configuration. So the Bull Fireman Racer features a Swiss automatic movement. It's an ETA 2824-2 25 joule movement. It's an all stainless steel watch. It's 316 stainless steel. The case diameter of this watch is 40 millimeters and it's about 11 millimeters thick. The crystal on this watch is a sapphire crystal with an anti-reflection coating on it. It features the hour, minutes, sweeping second hand and a date display under a cyclops magnification window for easy reading of the date. The bezel of this watch is fixed. It's a polished bezel. The rest of the watch is additionally polished and brushed finish. As I mentioned, the dial on this watch is a silver with blue. Some might call it a white. On the dial of the watch, it features 15 micro gas tubes that give it very easy night readability. You can see these at the index markers as well as on the hands. It features a screw down crown with the RR insignia for the railroads which is the start of ball watches. This watch is uh, water resistant to 100 meters or 330 feet. The rear of the watch case is a stainless steel screw down case back. Every watch is individually serial numbered. Additionally this watch features a brushed and polished stainless steel bracelet. These are solid links with precision machine screws holding each of the links together unlike other brands of watches that use pins that have to be banged out with a, a punch to size the, the bracelet by removing the links. These are simply precision machine screws and you would just use a precision screwdriver to remove the screws which is the same design as Rolex or Cartier, Ulysse Narden and many other high-end brands. Additionally this watch features a hidden clasp design it's a butterfly fold over type clasp with the ball logo insignia which is the RR once again for the birth of uh, ball watches Both these watches are very reasonably priced. At the time of this recording, they were $1,499 retail. Now there's something I want to point out about this model 
of ball watch and this price versus the features and quality you're getting. I mean, we're talking about a all stainless steel, very well built watch. Solid links in the bracelet with precision machine screws. Sapphire crystal, date display with magnification window, true sapphire crystal, true Swiss automatic movement, tritium gas tubes on the dial, and ball watches after you register register the watch after buying them from an authorized dealer you have a three year warranty. You're getting all this for a retail price of $14.99. If you compare that with other brands out in the market and a price of $14.99, the truth of the matter is there is no comparison. At $14.99 retail and other brands you're probably going to wind up with a watch that has lots of plastic on it is very flimsy and isn't built as precision and well crafted with the details and features that this watch has. The Ball Fireman Racer is one of the entry line watches to the Ball Collection and at this price point it really is a true steal. I really don't know at this price point another watch that gives you a truly automatic Swiss movement watch with the qualities and features and warranty as the Ball Fireman Racer.